fellas. We had to shift over the table a little bit because it was getting kind of crowded. Next up, we have Tiffany Usuriri Art. I actually have two boxes from her. This is uh, Tiffany is from Virginia. She is this beautiful resin art artist. And she doesn't, not only does she work with resin, she also works with other materials as well. Um, other forms of items. I just lost my train of thought. I'm so sorry. So, here we go. Oh! Oh, Tiffany, a gift just because. Oh, she gifted me something. Oh, okay, wait. I gotta take everything out the box first. So, if you've never bought from Tiffany before, you should. Her live shows are hilarious. But her work in itself is just super splendid. And she's famous for having these pink um, doohickeys here. So, let's start. Okay, so first up... I actually have two boxes from her, so let's unwrap both boxes and then we can start unboxing everything else to go with it. Here is the second. Now, Tiffany takes a whole lot of care into the entire process from how she invoices you, she sends you pictures, to how she ships items to you. Um, the process that she does it is her own timing. It may seem slow to many other people, but I honestly appreciate the time that and effort that she does to making sure your products get to you safe and sound. So Tiffany's definitely one of those people that I look up to and I absolutely adore. She's just fabulous. And honestly, I love her work. I have so much of her stuff. Also, if you did not know, Tiffany is the creator of the Resin Yodas that you guys will probably be seeing soon. Um, I love her. She's like obsessed with Yodas as much as I am and it's just so beautiful. All right, so let's start off with this. Oh, she then makes the beautiful beanies. I said I had a big head and look what she made. Oh! I'm gonna cry. Ah, there's a little resin unicorn. So she hand knits these and there's like a little labradorite um, crystal on here. So cute, a little pom-poms. These feel great. Winter's starting to end over here, but like, oh my God, they look so cute. Thank you so much, Tiff. She made a head wrap for me, yes. I live in New York, you guys, so we do have the Four Seasons, and it, it be it be brick out here. And she also got oh, these smell so good. So this is made by Blissful Home Candy. Thank you for your purchase. This is their uh, Instagram and their socials. So go follow them. This smells so yummy. What is this candy? I can't I can't pinpoint it. But it smells so sweet. So this is the free gift that um, if you purchase a beanie with Tiff, she gifted a candle. But Tiff had gifted this to me. So thank you so much, Tiffany. And this is her card. So you guys get fruit snacks. I love these. This is her card. Like if you guys can see the attention to detail that she does, it's amazing. So this is Tiffany Usuri artwork. Her username and everything. So go check her out, you guys. You feel so cute. And I got snacks for later. I love snacks. So let us begin. Oh, and I have a note. We love notes. Seriously, thank you. Oh, did you write? Oh, your handwriting, beautiful. Jeannie, you are such a beautiful soul, and I'm so appreciative you came into my life. Thank you so much for the beautiful painting of my two babies. You and Dana have the biggest hearts. I love you both. Uh, the black tourmaline and quartz plate was gifted to you by Steph. So just think, she just thinks you are so awesome. Such a beautiful person. 
and she loves how you always send out so much love to everyone she wants you to feel oh my goodness you guys oh so what tiffany is referring to is dana from i this crystal and i have reached out to this artist um her name is cash b oh my goodness i'm gonna forget uh, but she does this beautiful painting because Tiffany's uh, loving pet, Miley, had passed away recently. And we know, everybody knew how big Miley was to Tiff. And we commissioned this beautiful piece for her. And she's just like, this sweet is so, I'm so happy she loved it. And then apparently, it has made its way back to me in the form of a different gift by Steph from KKPLP. So let's see, you guys are so sweet. I'm gonna, I'm not okay. <laughs> All right, so let's see what the first thing is. Oh, okay, so here is the bottom of the boxes. I'm going to dump these out. I know you guys are like, what in the hell are you? what is this what's going on why is it just a box right just wait just give me a second because knowing tiffany she broke them all apart so that way they wouldn't break in transit and i think this goes with that one and like i said i love tiffany's attention to detail i love that she includes what the crystal is what the pricing and the dimensions of it all So, this is what it looks like. So, this has that beautiful rose gold copper look on the bottom. And this is the needle quartz that I had gotten. And this is resin that Tiffany makes and pours. And so, these are her beautiful resin boxes. And I love this because I wanted to store some of my very special malas in this box. So this is such a beautiful work of art. Like that is so stunning. I'm so excited. So what's next? What's next? Oh, this is the big box. So Temples and I's anniversary had recently passed. We hit uh, 10 years. And... That said for me to pick out something from Tiffany's live show for our anniversary present. And so this is the one that I had picked out. Once again, there's a bunch of pink poof. So here is the box. And here is the top for it. Looks like the bottom's another rose gold kind of copper look to it. I always forget what I buy, so this is like awesome. Okay, so oh my god! See what I mean by attention to detail? She like wrapped it up again just to make sure it would be okay. Look at this jersey amethyst. It's like sugar coated. And I love that she tries to maintain the beautiful crystals and not cover up as much of it. Oh my god, this is so nice. Ah, I'm dying. I'm deceased. 
I am dead. And I rose back up because I need to finish unboxing the rest of them. <laughs> so here's another one. Okay, so this is the mini series. This is the one that had like the smaller ones in it. Oh, yes. Yeah. So this one is the Apophyllite. I have like a soft spot for Apophyllite, you guys. So there's a little bit of still bite on it. This peach still bite with beautiful Apophyllite. Apophyllite comes from India. So here's a little mini one. This one can definitely hold like rings and stuff in it. So there's that one. Next up. more pink poofs i still don't remember what they're called peanuts are they called peanuts <sighs> yes this beautiful black one so this is galena right am i correct it is it is galena it is a toxic material so be careful handling anything like this just don't rub it in your eyes and you know don't put it in your mouth don't lick it and stuff like that we don't want that this is gorgeous beautiful pieces and she sourced these pieces from other crystal shops and she puts it within her works oh this is so nice i was always blown away by tiffany's work but holy crap this is even best and i believe this is the gift that i had received so let's see what she looks like a gift for you oh. I love this community so much. I'm always, I love gifting things to people, but she gifted this. This is so nice. Tiffany, your artwork is just stunning. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. Thank you so much, Steph. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Yeah, so Steph at KKPLP. Thank you so much, darling. This was like the nicest surprise I've gotten. So you guys, please go check out Tiffany Osterary artwork and tell her I sent her, sent you guys to her. <laughs> All right, my love. So we are down to the last two boxes and they are from Me Time. If you guys have the chance, go check out these beautiful ladies. I got two big boxes from them. I went in and splurged. These ladies are so fun. They were so, just so accommodating. Absolutely adore them. And they are in Je uh, Jeffersonville, Indiana. Ooh, yes, first thing we see. Okay, I gotta just pour everything out this box. So, shall we? I'm so excited. So these girls are curators of wonderful apothecary items. Um, definitely items that you would want on your altar space. Just very unique items, very witchy vibes to say the least. So this is the first box. Let's just kind of situate them. And then I'm gonna crack open the second box. So let's put that there. Ugh. For the second box, let's get going. Okay, so we have so much. There's another box. Oh, 
this is everything. I think that's everything. Okay. Woo! Okay, you guys, so let's start off. Let's get these ladies out here. So I got a, oh, it's a body wash. Tempted Coconut Kiss, nice. We love that. This is by Me Time. Love the logo. This is so cute. Boutique for the energetically open. So go hit them up. This is their IG. Go say hey. Tell them Jeannie sent you. We got a little sticker. It's a Hansa sticker. We got some tumbos. Looks like orange, aventurine, and labradorite. And one of the creators is Night Owl Crafting. She's fabulous. So she's the one that worked on the resin pieces for me. And they are comprised, Me Time is comprised by a couple of ladies. And they all have like their own secret talents, I swear. So we got a little, a little scully, some marbles in here. We got a tea light candle. Love these for everything. And we got some banana magnets. Ooh. These are resin banana magnets. They're cute. So these, I believe, are the freebies. Let us begin. We have a... So this is an incense holder. Very nice. You would stick your little incense here, and it would just catch all the, um, the things that... I don't know what they're... The ashes that come from it. So this is very, very cute. I'm going to put her here. This big boy is a mystery box. I'm going to open him last because he's going to probably have quite a... Ah, there's a, quite a bit of stuff in there. So, I'm going to open him last. So, we'll leave that there. Let's start off with this one. So, I had gotten some gorgeous metal boxes. This is a beautiful rose gold one. And I loved it because the inside is felt lined. So you can put in anything. You can put your spell jars in here. You can put your blood of your enemies. You can put whatever your heart desires in here. And I thought it was gorgeous. So I got one in rose gold. I have no space on my table. So I was just going to just put this here for the time being. I did not plan this out. And then I also got one in a silver box silver box reason why is because it had a lotus on it same thing nice beautiful clasp has that felt on the inside super cute so these are the two boxes I had gotten I had also gotten a now I'm not a fan of Ouija boards I don't like the concept of them, but I had to admit this was so pretty. Like, look at her. There's flowers that are pressed on the inside of it. It's so pretty. And this is only 15, y'all. Let me take that off. So, she's gorgeous. I loved it. And I love the little pink accents to her. So, she's just a little resin piece that I really, really adored. And I got the, so these are pendulum boards that are also made out of resin. Beautiful flowers. And if you have a pendulum, you would hang the pendulum and it's going to um, circle in whatever direction it needs to. And it would tell you some questions, but I just love how beautiful this looked. I'm not very versed in the pendulum board, so I can't give too much info on it. But I think this is stunning. So simple. So there's one. And seeing that I just could not say no that live sale, I had gotten a second one. But this one's a very green looking one. Very summer, springtime vibe. So I got these two very very beautiful next up we got ah 
Oh, yes. I had gotten some selenite obelisks. So I have a the moon phases with the triple moon down here and a goddess one. And these are made out of selenite. So this is gorgeous, gorgeous colorations. Ah, I love it. So this is definitely going on the altar. And I bought a lot of these so that I can utilize them within my pictures that I take. But they're just so beautiful. Next up, let's see what we got. Oh, yes. This is a incense um, backflow, I think it's what they're called. So this is the triple moon one. And you would put your, um, it's like incense cones that you would put here. And it would backflow and it would come out here and spit out like vapors. It's so cute. Ah, I can't wait to get some so I can put it on and see how it works. Next up. We have this gorgeous golden hand not only can it act as a tea light holder or a volatile um, candle like the small ones it can also hold spheres if you had any spheres definitely can use that to you to hold them really cute gold color all right so last package we have here is... oh yes it's another beautiful incense burner so you would put um, your cone there and you would put this on top and it would release the scent from the top. Look how beautiful that is. Super cute. That's why I'm saying like, there are items that you definitely could use for your own altar piece. Um, if you have created a space for yourself, this is definitely where you should be getting your stuff. Now, last but not least we have this big boy let me stand him up so i had bought this as a mystery item box and let's see what it's filled with Ooh, so we got some candles this one's cinnamon scented oh so we got two candles we got some stickers Ooh, another beautiful wild musk body wash that's so cute we got a, oh, we have sage and rose petals. So another wonderful um, smudge to use to cleanse your items. We got a candle for your rituals. We have an etched um, Palo Santo stick with the flower of life etching. We got some tumbles here. So Unakai, I think it's a jasper and amethyst. I have some lip balm. It is organic coconut oil, shea butter, beeswax, and vitamin E. Oh yes, that smells great. So we got that and then we got a ring. It is a planet, let's see. Oh yes, so that was this one. And then we have more in here. Let's see. Ooh, we have a little amethyst DT. DT means double termination. And I believe this might have a little bit of citrine, which causes it to be ametrine. Oh, yeah. So this is super nice. So here we have that. We have an abalone shell. This is perfect for your smudging. You can uh, smudge it in the shell so that way it catches your, your items. Oh, they stuffed this with so many goodies. Oh, my God. Okay, so we have a moon magnet. We have a pink tourmaline quartz point. Lapidolite. Um, sorry, not lapidolite. It's pink tourmaline with a little bit of smoky, but no lapidolite on this one. We have a green aventurine moon. 
a sardonyx palm stone oh yes this looks like it's either graphite or lead but it's really cool we have this chakra here we go a wooden chakra hanger so you can definitely hang it up so nice we have a dalmatian jasper pendulum which is perfect for my pendulum boards oh there's so much in here you guys oh we have a little druzy um what is this a druzy calcite it might be actually Druzy Amethyst, but like the Dark Amethyst one. We have a green sunstone. So this is a man-made crystal, but still they are fabulous in itself. We have a little Orca Agate. Uh, sorry, or Orceo Agate. It's a type of Druzy Agate. We got some adjustable bracelets. There's an evil eye on here. It's a glass evil eye super nice y'all there's still so much so there's another piece we have a petrified wood and a labradorite cabochon oh yes we have a little hanger ornament we have a spell jar Ooh, love this this is definitely handmade oh I have the Tiny Try Me Kit of Blendable Perfume Collection. And I have a New Moon Soap. Oh, this is so cute. It's lavender and vanilla. Is that everything? I believe that's everything. This was so cute. And the box itself is such a cute little piece. Oh. So, you guys, that was a lot. It was a lot of stuff. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining me. This was once again from me time. I am going to list the description of um, all the shops that I have purchased from. And you guys, please go check them out. Go say hey. Say Jeannie sent y'all. Y'all saw her on YouTube. Oh my goodness. This is so much stuff. So I got to put this all away. Thank you guys so much. And see you guys next time. Bye.